Hello, everybody. Welcome back. It is me, your old pal, Captain Orpheus, here on the USS Enterprise <laughs> with another edition of Orpheus Plays. And today I want to give you just a really simple, quick tip. If you want to play games on your Quest 2 without having that, uh, that cord that hangs across your ceiling, you know what I'm talking about, sticks into the back of your head, makes you feel like you're a cyborg, like you're Neo jacking into the Matrix. Instead of doing all that, there's a much simpler way to do it that doesn't have any caps on bitrate and you don't have to have that silly cable. So what we're going to do, we're going to kick things off. What you want to do is go on your computer and make sure that you install something called Virtual Desktop. It is an app for your PC that you can easily install and it allows you to stream it to this app called Virtual Desktop. It's really simple. This does cost $19.99 on the App Store, but don't worry about that. What you're getting out of this in terms of value, saving yourself hassle, is absolutely incredible. You just download this, and then you'll bring it up on your computer. I would do it here, but it gives my audio a little bit of stuttery lag going on for some reason. It's just that app. But when as soon as you open up that app, you'll be able to see your desktop on your computer. But more than that, there is a menu that automatically comes up that shows you all these things your connected computers what kind of environment you want you can have one that looks like an apartment in a city where you're sitting at your desk you can have the settings on all that where you can increase your bit rate and all that it also will allow you to view videos that are on your PC here in the VR headset including VR movies uh, any of the big blockbusters that are out but it's also got this games tab now this is the important part it will automatically search for games on your PC and bring them up in this area right here and boom! You can start up your Oculus games, you can bring up your Steam games, Blade and Sorcery runs amazing on this as well. You can get the PC version here on the headset without having to have all those cords and wires and all that stuff and worrying about your battery life and everything like that. It will be incredible, and I hope that tip helped you out today. Anyway, we'll see you on the next one here on Orpheus Plays. Tune in for more silly hack and slash with me on Blade and Sorcery in the next one. We'll see you then. Bye!